Cheers, friends. <laughs> Bye, Snoops. Cheers, friends. Hey there. Welcome to Knott's Berry Farm. The peanut celebration. It is a busy day here today at Knott's Berry Farm. It's just a little after 10 and we already had a park in the western lot, which is actually behind the park. So the peanut celebrations when Charlie Brown and the gang take over the whole park. So during the celebration there are a lot of extra meet and greets, fun shows, and tasty treats for the family to eat. Hey Big Ben! Let's dive into my favorite part of these festivals, the food. Knott's comes up with some really interesting food combinations, which can be hit or miss. So if you're coming for the food, I highly recommend you look into Knott's dining package. I'm really surprised by how many menu items are available in the package, including some of the holiday items. We talked about it in a previous video, I'll link that below. <laughs> This thing is heavy. It's crazy. Like two pounds of potato or something. It's nuts. Yeah. Definitely $16 worth of food here. That's crazy. Just trying to cut it open there so you can see how thick this thing is. But yeah, lots of bacon bits, lots of pork, pineapple, barbecue sauce. This is definitely a potato built for two. I can only do half. These are the pepperoni pizza tops. The marinara kind of soaks through the top. That makes them soggy. Nice spicy pepperoni. I like that it's cooked too. Maybe less marinara sauce. Still, you get a lot of food with it. Less sauce, more pepperoni. Yeah. Nothing to do with less sauce. Now, this one is not on the meal package, but I just had to try this cornbread funnel cake with honey and pulled pork. Oh my gosh, another massive treat. This thing is so heavy. I was expecting the powdered sugar to still be on there. A little sweet barbecue. So this is another heavy meal. But actually good. I thought it was going to be too sweet because there's still powdered sugar on here. But the pork and the barbecue sauce is so savory. It really does kind of balance out. But again, it's heavy. You got the pork, you got the fried cornbread. And actually, I actually think fried cornbread might be my favorite kind of funnel cake now. It's really good just by itself. But for $19, $20, you definitely split this. This is the chocolate bacon and jam burger at Sutter's Grill. Another unique combination here at Knott's Berry Farm. So the burger patty is just okay. Very bland. Reminds me of what you got at the cafeteria in school. On strawberry jam with some chocolate sauce mixed in and some mediocre bacon. So this dish is trying to go for something sweet and savory. And there's plenty of sweet, not enough savory. Three chicken taco plates, beans and rice. Strictly on a stick. Now, according to the peanuts, 
celebration guy, they're supposed to have some buffalo chicken on a stick, as well as mac and cheese crunch on a stick. But I don't see any of the signs up. Hi, do you guys have the mac and cheese crunch stick? Uh, we do not. Uh, I'll do um, just the regular hand-dipped corn dog basket. You guys just all sold out of them, or? No, um, our products fell, so it's unfortunately we had to cancel our items over here. Oh, that sucks. Now it looks like it has potential. I like the coloring on the dog, but I am optimistic. I didn't know, but there's cheese in it with this dog. I can't say that it really adds anything to it. It is a good all beef hot dog. I think the uh, batter would need to be a little crispier. But it is a good corn dog. Camp Snoopy is the kids' area and the Peanuts Gang's regular hideout. Translator. Cheers, friends. It was crazy crowded, tons of little kids, but a lot of really cool rides. Um, you know, from like little toddlers all the way up to like the pre roller coaster age. And some of them looked pretty intense. But during the celebration, Snoopy and the gang take over the whole park. The Peanuts crew will have meet and greets going on throughout the park for photo opportunities and to play games with the kids. You can even learn to draw one of your favorite Peanuts characters. Cat school is very popular. Sign your name. It's very important. Ready down here? I'm going to sign my name. I hope you guys will too. Nailed it. The celebration brings a lot of fun activities. They take the stage and put on some fun performances. So it's the end of the night and we're taking off. This peanut celebration was a lot of fun. The portions of these food is amazing. What well, you get, the value for it, can't say you'll get it at any other festival at any other park. The peanut celebration is definitely something you have to do at least once. The shows were great. I really enjoyed the It's Your Life Charlie Brown, but the Snoopy Rock and Roll Hall of Fame music show at the end of the night. That probably was my favorite. Now, a lot of the peanut celebration treats that they had were unfortunately 
not gluten-free, so I couldn't try a lot of them, but they do have a delicious gluten-free cookie that the couple of times we've been here, I always make sure I head to that bakery and get one. Um, all in all, I think today was a great success. I had a lot of fun, and I think we'd come back. It's a lot of fun for the whole family, and it's a great thing to do here in the wintertime. I believe some events are only available on the weekends. So I'd say that the best thing I ate today was that funnel cake. I was really surprised. I thought it was going to be way too sweet, but the savoriness of the barbecue sauce and the pork really do balance it out. And I think the cornbread funnel cakes are probably my favorite funnel cakes now. And the best show was, of course, the Snoopy Rock and Roll show, just like Gina said. Um, we saw both shows, there were two showings. And I can't say that the later show was any less crowded than the first one. Um, definitely get there about 20, 30 minutes early so you can get a good seat and enjoy the show. All right, friends, well, that's going to do it from us here at Knott's Berry Farm. Again, we appreciate all of our friends we've made here on YouTube. Thank you all for subscribing. Let us know what you thought down in the comments below. And until next time, friends, cheers. <laughs>